Good morning, St. Pius. Today is Monday, June 3rd, 2024. Uh, remember Friday, we had no birthdays. We've got lots of birthdays we're celebrating today. Happy birthday in third grade to Zane and Grace. Happy birthday in first grade to Anthony, George, and Ethan. And in second grade to Grace and JJ. Happy birthday, everyone. Um, hot lunch, we've got mac and cheese or grab bag. Uh, after school, nothing. Uh, tomorrow, archery has been canceled. Uh, it'll be remade on Thursday. Uh, tomorrow, some of our eighth graders will be taking uh, Algebra 1 Regents. Good luck to you guys. Uh, and Wednesday will be band, choir, and hand bells recital. Right, so a busy week. Uh, it's going to be a beautiful day weather-wise, high of 86. So let's make sure we're, we're staying hydrated, uh, drinking lots of water. Uh, our spike shout out. So, um, what an awesome day we had on Friday, right? Spirit day. Um, just, uh, just a great day. So thank you to everyone who made it special. Um, and that includes you guys, right? Um, just like I said last week, every teacher who I talked to, every volunteer, uh, just said how awesome and well behaved that you guys were. So that just, that just makes it, right? We can't do fun days like this, uh, if we're unable to control ourselves. And, and, and a couple of my friends struggle to control themselves, but I, the most part, you guys did an awesome job, uh, great behavior on Spirit Day. Um, and, of course, a big shout-out to the teachers uh, for the big kickball victory over the eighth graders. Uh, Coach Hamlin informed me it was the, the largest margin of victory that he can remember. Uh, and he's pretty old, so I believe that. Um, that's okay. I can say that he doesn't watch these anyways. All right, here we go. It's easy to get wrapped up in the power and majesty of God to want to find the perfect words of prayer, the perfect time to pray. But God wants to be a friend to each of us. God doesn't want perfect. He just wants our presence, like any friend would. Today is the memorial of St. Charles Langa and Friends. St. Charles lived in the kingdom of Buganda, which is part of Uganda today. He and many other Christian converts were martyred for refusing to give up their new faith. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. A reading from the book of Exodus. Now Moses used to take the tent and pitch it outside the camp, far off from the camp. He called it the tent of meeting, and everyone who sought the Lord would go out to the tent of meeting. When Moses entered the tent, the pillar of cloud would descend and stand at the entrance of the tent, and the Lord would speak to Moses. When all the people saw the pillar of cloud standing at the entrance of the tent, all the people would rise and bow down, all of them, at the entrance of the tent. Thus the Lord used to speak to Moses face to face, as one speaks to a friend. Then he would return to the camp, but his young assistant, Joshua, son of Nun, would leave the tent. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Think about this today. How do you talk to God? like he is a friend. We can talk to God when we pray. And with that, let us stand in prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great Monday, everyone.